What's up guys? I'm Shane. Welcome back to the first era of our relegation league. Oh, the scouting gods were good to us with this. So, all those people that I threw on the board in the beginning of the season, thinking that we had a shot at that 78 overall outside linebacker, man, there's some gems out here. You can see their overalls right now. Terrence Sledge, plus 5, 79 overall, 95 speed, 93 excel. Yes, please. Paul Hill, athlete, stays a 78. Not very fast, pretty decent excel. Um, looks like he's going to be a linebacker or a safety, which we need. Good coverage skills. Not very strong hitter, so I'm guessing more of a free safety. Winston, we don't even necessarily need a wide receiver, but 80 overall gem? I will gladly, gladly take that. Mark Holy Cross, plus 5, he's a 75 overall. Plenty of corners which is good, we need him. Offensive lineman, this is this is the best I could find. A 73 overall guard. I think we're just stuck with what we got. Troy Dodds, plus five gem, the tight end. We need one of those. We need a bunch of those, actually. Yeah, offensive lineman, I find the bust. You know, my favorite position. Carter down here, plus two, 72 overall linebacker, not bad. DeAndre Sanchez, plus three, strong safety. And Warren, 75 overall safety. 92 speed, 89 excel for Warren. Sanchez, 88 and 86. So I found some real good secondary help, which is where we are decimated going in the next season. Everyone but like three players is a freaking senior. So all my points are going to them. Now, if you look here at the top of the board, Hubbard, we fell another 200 points back at Illinois. Looks like they're going after him. I might keep him around. Maybe we'll like get a bonus. We can start doing kitchen sink or something soon. We're still, like, two upgrades away from that, though, so I don't think that's actually going to happen. But then, like, I'm throwing points at, like, a 64 overall corner, a 68 offensive lineman, 64 tight end. So I'm actually going to take all the points away from the trash. Uh, You know what? I'm just going to cut bait with Hubbard. It'd be cool, but we're going to cut bait. And I'm going to go after Sledge, Hill, Winston, Holy Cross, uh, Elliot... Uh, Dodds at tight end. Both the safeties. We'll go after Carter. And we'll throw 400 at him. We're not going to offer scholarships to any of these guys. Because they don't actually register until after. I know it's unlikely, but if we can sign all three of these guys. The cornerback, the athlete, who I'll put at cornerback probably or something. The other corner. And in these two safeties. Whatever the combination is, I'll move them all around. That's our secondary set. We're done. We don't have to go on over anyone else except for maybe some, like, backup corners. But even if I got to move Hill over to, like, free safety or something, he's pretty slow. He's not the best option, but that's still going to be two starting cornerbacks and two starting safeties. We're done. An 80 overall wide receiver. Now we're going to have two wide receivers who are solid. We can keep adding more because those are the guys who keep showing up in low lock cheese. We're going to have quarterbacks settled as long as that other guy doesn't transfer. Offensive line is going to be an issue. Defensive line, we're still going to need to de-tackle. Linebackers, iffy, but at least they're all going to be around for the whole run. If we get Dodds, that's our tight end. So really after this, there's not a lot of pressing needs on a team other than a halfback, which I feel like I should be able to stumble upon one of those eventually. I didn't see anyone this year that I really love. I'll go back later if we clear up some points, but if we can get this... That's the secondary and defensive line set. And the linebackers, offensive line, pretty good shape. Wide receivers, pretty good shape. So overall, this is going to be a good recruiting class if we can nail all these picks. I don't know if we can, but let's hope. Bowling Green is a better overall offense than us, but the actual overall of the team, we're relatively close. So hopefully I play well and we can keep this reasonable. Next week would be Old Dominion and the start of our conference schedule. So that's the one I'm more focused on, but... Hopefully, we can get these through these pretty quickly. Got the blocks. Oh, made one guy miss. Got that up. 42-yard return. All right, how's the run going to go today? All right, still six yards. Nothing big like last week, but that's way better than we were managing last year against the uh, mediocre competition. Nice drag route for Wade. Third and three. All right. We got to go a little more methodical here today, apparently. Montgomery got open across the middle. More with the keeper. Nice gap. Oh, tried to slide. Didn't work. Oh, Frazier fights his way in. All right. Good run. 
Got a good truck on there, too. And just stumbled over the pile. And he got back up. Are you kidding me? The garbage. And, oh, good tackle by Peterson. Thank you, conservative tackle. And we injured him somehow. On, like, the softest... Like, it's the softest tackle I've ever seen. Eh, he'll be back soon. He's fine. Oh, beautiful cut there by Frazier. Again, when the impact blocking is there for the right guard, and the fact that I'm, like, smart enough to make a good cut, these run plays start opening up. Nice snag by Hawthorne. He's worked his way all the way up to a 68 overall now. Oh, Moore might be able to pick this one up. Come on. Oh, he can't truck through. Mason open. Picks up the first down. That's all I care about right now. Oh, God. Oh, God. <laughs> no, I should have stuck with this read option. Well... Right now, what we're going to do is we're going to halt that Johnson, who I didn't think would see the field again. Oh, they got the blitz coming. I'm actually going to take Johnson and put him on a streak and hope this works. I hit the wrong button. Pinned down at the two. Not that it matters. I don't know why we don't just automatically go on the goal line on this. Oh, Alston with the good stop. Oh, that was my zone, wasn't it? Yep. Renegade seems like it's dangerous. Oh, it worked. Uh, he ran out and then went out of bounds. Only two yards on that. We're going to get the ball back. we got to run a two-minute drill, though. All of the statistics for the offensive players and defense, like everyone's stats, are going to suffer by playing five-minute quarters, but I'm not really concerned with that in this. Nice snag by Fuller. Good set up for first down. Run the hurry up. We're more dink and dunk. We, we can't really mess around and just assume that we need to kill the clock. And R1 open. Oh my god, that guy's fast. What I think is funny, I, I don't remember almost any of these plays from last season. I don't know where they're coming from. I don't know why I'm running them. I need to get like six yards out of this at least. That was terribly inaccurate. Up 7 nothing going into halftime. They're going to get the ball to start. These guys cannot play zone. Every time I call zone, they just, like, pick us apart. There's no point. I I'm going to start relying more on man, I think. Okay, and that's what happens when I play man. Mm. And, yep. Perfect. Found Montgomery. I was looking for Wade originally, and they all drifted towards him, so that left the middle of the field open. Oh, my God. Wade. Goodbye. Please not run. Oh, he's not fast enough. He's quick, but he's only got like 88 speed. So for us, he's fast, but he's probably slower than all their defenders. Ooh, good truck by Hawthorne. The blocks got there. Slide down. Ah, oh, Frazier held onto it. Thank you. And there we go. All right, Harris getting in with a touchdown instead. Frazier must have been tired. Thank you! Oh, Fry with the pick! Run that in. Come on, bud. Oh, just like that. We turn it around. We had that covered up. Oh, yeah. I can't believe he caught that, to be fair. <laughs> they were dropping everything last year. What did we get, one interception last year? All right, we're up two. We'll super sim this drive. All right, defense forced to three and out. Honestly, I might even just start, like, chewing clock. I know the game's already quick enough, but... Oh, right over the top to Montgomery. Big play. Go on. You're not supposed to make 43 yards on a slant. Oh, down for a sack. They don't want me to get this score. All right, just pick up, like, seven or eight yards. That's all. That's all I want. Mason across the middle here would be good. No one covered Mason. That is exactly... I don't care that I didn't get the first down. We'll run this clock all the way down. About three minutes left. Kick a field goal. The ball centered. 39 yarders should be able to make this pretty easily. 
Okay, good. I can't take that down to the last second on a kick. I almost lost five yards. 24-7. We'll sim the next defensive drive, too. And if we get the ball back, I'm just going to chew clock. All right, they marched down. They scored a touchdown. Took them about a minute to do it, too. We got a minute 51 left trying to kill the clock now. Nice pancake by 61. Oh, 61 is a lucky number for us with offensive lineman Clark over at North Texas. That was a pretty incredible pancake. 78, our center. I almost benched him. Only because we have a sophomore. Oh, the draw play. That's the first time it's ever worked for me. We have a sophomore center who's a 72 overall. I almost gave him the start. Oh, nice downfield block. Good cut. That's their last time out. This will salt away the game now. My tack on a field goal at the end unless we get in for a touchdown. Because I don't take knees. Uh, well, I screwed up. I thought I had Montgomery open. That guy just snagged the ball out of our hands. It's fine. That's game anyways. All right, that's not bad. A 10-point victory at an actual good school. Someone who's a higher overall than us. Frazier had a good game. 60 yards on only 8 carries. So it's not just FCS. We can actually get the ball moving on the ground now. Thank goodness. All right, more 18-26, 211 yards, no touchdowns, and a pick on the last play. Rushing 12 yards for more. Those read options weren't working for him that well. Frazier was doing pretty good. 8 for 60 and a touchdown. Morris, 2 carries, no yards, and a touchdown. Frazier, 4 catches for 19 yards. Montgomery, 3 for 72, including that beautiful 43-yarder. Mason at 3 for 30. Wade, 3 for 45. Thornton with 7 tackles. Peterson and Alston with 5 apiece. Alston and Peterson with the only TFLs. Didn't have any sacks, but Fry with a pick 6. All right, let's jump forward a week. I'm going to give you guys a, the quickest recap I possibly can on recruiting, if there's anything to update you on at all. And then we'll go into Old Dominion and start our conference schedule. All right, cool. Looks lo looks like no one actually wants to come here. That That's great. Oh, rain game here. Looks like we're going to have to rely on the run a lot more. And I picked a bad day to wear all white. All right, Moore starts off with a pretty good run. 10 yards. I'm actually conservative on big runs today. We're not breaking a ton of tackles, but I don't want to fumble the ball. Oh, my God. Oh, that was terrible. That had to be the rain, right? There's a good pass to Mason. I actually kind of like Old Dominion Stadium here. I don't know how it is in real life, but in the game, I like it. Oh. Oh, the inaccuracy. We're not going to be able to throw the ball much today. Like, we're going to have to stick with short passes, it looks like. Slide, take it there, fourth and five. Up and barely through. All right, well, we can make 45 yarders now. Ooh, nice little dump off to him. Third and one, all right. Whoa. Oh, I jumped offside, so that's unfortunate. I was trying to go back for Fry, and uh, I was not controlling the right person, jumped offside, so that that's my bad. Oh, we missed the tackle. He's trying to knock the ball out. Oh, he broke off Thornton, too. Jump off sides once, and it's ruined this entire game for us. All right, well, good job, defense. Oh, Barnes out here getting a kick return. Technically a better returner. It shows right there. Good snag. Perfect. I know I can rely on you. So I thought the white sets were a mistake here, but they play on turf. So I guess we're fine. Oh, that was not a truck, Frazier. Not even close. All right, basically, I'm just hoping for Mason in the corner. There it is. Third and three to hold him in field goal range. Perfect. Tackle him forward a little bit, but we got him down behind the line of scrimmage. They're not going to bother with the field goal. I don't know if their kicker sucks or if they're just going to go aggressive. I got there with Fry, but he got over the line. Oh, that was a screen. I haven't seen one of those. In oh, my God. He just made Thornton look like a scrub. <laughs> okay. All right, Noble. Taking him down. Another fourth and one. Now what are they going to do? They're going to stay aggressive. Looks like they're just going to take a timeout and kick the field goal. 
No, they did it. And he nope. was wide open. Mm. Oh, we... <sighs> Dang it. Quack. Oh, my God. That was a terrible cut by Montgomery. He, like, rounded off that one. He's supposed to take a sharp cut inside. And he just sort of meandered around. Now we just gave them the ball in scoring position, and the defense can't stop them. What is happening? I didn't do a replay, nothing. The game glitched itself out. Now, even in slow motion, they scored the touchdown. Oh, I think I just blew this game. Ah, we're down 11. Um, I'll give it the good old college try in the second half, but might be starting off with an 0-1 conference record. Thank All right, you. so I decided to super sim their first drive because we are down by two scores, and uh, Thornton got his first pick. Well, the read options are a lot more lethal now. Oh, maybe not. Uh, yeah, okay, I tried to fix it. Still didn't work. Frazier with a big catch, though. Yeah, I saw our one there. But look at what Moore can do. Out of bounds. Oh, they shove him down at the end. Read option. Cut it in. Moore in for the touchdown. No, not with this. Oh, the safety. Yeah, we got it. Somehow, Frazier squeaked in. Oh, he, he blew right past us, and I was trucking. I thought we tripped and landed at the one. Come on, get him down for the... Yeah, there we go. All right, good stop, defense. Perfect block. Frazier up the... Where is he at now? I can't tell. Is that the 30-something? 28? I think it's the 28-yard line. Yep, good. One year of progression and a couple good recruits, and you see how big of a difference that makes already. That's why I was salivating at that draft class. Like, if we could have gotten all those recruits, oh, we could have been the national champion next year. Okay, maybe not. I'm trying to stay quiet as much as possible just because it's in slow motion. Like, this is really, really bad. Inaccurate as all hell. Oh, my God. I led him all the way to the left, and he still threw it behind him. That should have at least gone the other way. You know, I was thinking, I'm like, oh, first game we didn't throw a pick. Second game we threw one to, like, the end of the game. This is going a lot better this year. No. Get him down. Fourth and one. They're not going to go for this one, right? I'm going to go chew clock here because uh, I just want to get the win and get out of here, and the game's in slow motion. If we score a touchdown here, we can drain most of this clock. That's, like, perfect. What was that? Why would you just stand there? Oh my god, is this about to be a pick six to a linebacker? Because the game is in slow motion, I'm I'm reacting the same way I normally do. I thought for sure he was going to make that an out route. Why would he stop? Like, why would you stop there? I mean, yay, they missed the extra point. I just went from chewing clock to try and kill the rest of the game to now I need to run hurry up. Oh, there's some blocks that no one picked up this guy. Oh, Mason, please be open. So I don't trust anyone else on this team now. Thank you. Good catch by Montgomery. I was hoping to get it to him for a little more speed. Oh, again? I have to, I mean, I basically have to force passes now. I'm pretty sure that's ball game, especially if they get a score here. Let's see if the defense can do anything, but I'm going to sim it because we're down two scores. Thank you. They fumbled it immediately. <laughs> okay. Thanks. Accurately thrown ball. How about that? And someone hangs on to it. There's a catch by Wade. See, he can do it. Oh my god, hang on to this, Wade. Fine, thank you. Thank you for actually holding on to a pass. 
He'll be good by, like, his junior, senior year, you know, but I need him to be good now. Oh, more with the good cut in for the touchdown. All right, game's not over yet. And I'm gonna let the computer handle the defense again because this is running way too long. The defense has forced him to three and outs over and over. We did do that. Our problem right now is that I've thrown three picks in the second half. Th th that's our big problem. Rankin with a step. Fuller here. Oh, Fuller everywhere. They brought that heavy blitz. Empty backfield. What are you thinking? Fuller with a nice catch. Can we get that over the first down marker? Yes, we can. Montgomery with a big snag. Down to the 30. Another snag by Fuller. He's lethal on slants. Speaking of... Oh my god, I just remembered that we're up by two. Or we're down by two, not three. Oh, I should have just been killing the clock here. Handoff up the middle. Frazier right down at the goal line. Perfect spot. I'm actually going to read option. I'm just going to give it to Frazier and just get it over a little bit. And we'll just take the field goal. Perfect. Oh my god, how... Oh, okay, I thought they did it again. Alright, we got this. It's an extra point. That's through. That's the dub. Oh. The defense is now good enough where I can throw four picks in a game, and we still win. Stupid slow motion. Oh, another ESPN Classic against Old Dominion. We move to 3-0, 1-0 in the conference. Moore somehow still gets player of the game. All right, stats on the day. Moore, 17-28, 223 yards, one touchdown, four picks. His touchdown to interception ratio is not looking good right now. Rushing, 69 yards on the ground for Moore with two touchdowns. Frazier at 10 for 44. Receiving Mason, 5 for 57 and a touchdown. Fuller at 3 for 30, Frazier 2 for 39, Montgomery 2 for 33, Wade for 2 for 35. It says only one drop, but I feel like it was more than that. Thornton led the day with five tackles, also had the only pick on the day. Fry with the only TFL, and that was also the sack. Walker with a pass deflection, he also scooped up a fumble, and he forced it too. And Sims with two field goals, including the game winner at the end. All right, so that'll wrap up this extra long episode. Thank you, slow motion. Hopefully I cut most of that out. Thank you guys for watching. If you liked the video, please be sure to hit like down below. If you want to see more from me, be sure to subscribe. Hit that notification bell to get it delivered directly to your inbox every single time I upload. Do you guys like the new format? Do you think I'm still terrible at this game, even with a better team? Leave all your thoughts down in the comment section below. Everything you leave down there, I will always respond to, unless you are the trolliest of trolls. Thank you guys for watching. I'm Shane. I'm out.